Jemima Betran, a great Muay Thai fighter, you know, she's an accomplished fighter, WBC champion, Muay Thai champion, she's a world champion, so has a lot of fights, you know, young girl, only 23 years old, but has a lot of fights under her belt and great athlete, amazing student, and works hard, trains hard, and it's going to be interesting working with her, and I've been working with her for the past two months, and it's been a pleasure, she's a great athlete. She's looking great now, doing a transition into MMA, you know, putting some work in the gym, and she has up and coming fight at the gas at the casino on the 10th. She's ready, she's been sparring with the girls, you know, Shayna Baszler, and she's been getting a lot of good rounds in, been grappling, wrestling with Martin, and she, she's looking very good. Jemima again is um, just a very, very hard worker, you know, has that killer instinct, you know, she puts it together and she wants to go for the finish every time, you know. She's, she's amazingly a, a gifted fighter, you know, she's born a fighter. Her spirit and her attitude when she gets into the ring to fight, you know, she just, she puts it together. She's, she's exciting to watch, she's relentless, she, she wants to go for the finish every time, so everything, her, her work at everything. You know, inspires me. She, she, she looks great. Marina um, has been working very, very hard. You know, since now she understands what a professional fighter is. She puts in a lot of time into the gym and into her work. She's learning a lot of skills. You know, she's getting way better. Her striking is coming along, it's looking very good. She's learning every day and she's willing to learn every day. She's working very, very hard. So I'm real pleased with her, what, what she has done until up to now. Having Edmund as my coach allows me to be the fighter that I really am inside. He's uh, allowing that spirit to come out more and directing it so well in training and like molding it and refining it. And it's just the fighter that I've become is way more aggressive, a lot smarter, calculated. Hopefully, rather sooner than later, he can say that I'm a fighter that has bad intentions when I get into the octagon, because I do, and that's what I'm grasping, having Edmund as my trainer. If there is no pressure, there is no diamonds, and that's what I'm turning into, is I'm gonna be a real solid diamond with all the help that I've been getting in this gym from all these monsters that just come through this door. Personally, I am hard on myself because that's how I was raised. It's how my parents brought me up. You're always, you always want the best out of yourself and you always want to perform or do the best you can. I'm hard on myself because I know I can do better. On August 10th at KS the Casino at Hollywood Park Casino in Torrance, I'm going to prove to the world that they should not be sleeping on me. And I'm not just hyped and people need to start paying attention.